All right, y'all, in this video, I'm gonna be teaching y'all how to get the footage from the camcorder onto the computer because people have been asking me and it's really not that difficult of a process, but it does require a process. It's not as simple as an SD going into a computer and you distract it. I'm gonna be telling y'all how the camcorders work. I'm gonna be telling you what you need because you do need to buy something. The camcorder that I have is it's a Sony Video High 8. Look at that, look shit up on it. Boom, skis, okay, boom. If y'all don't know how these work, these are run on a cassette. If I press the button here and take it out, here's a cassette. You can buy these on Amazon. So the way that these machines, basically, how they work is that it's a camera, but also a video player. So that's the reason why it even has the whole play stop fast forward. Cause if you look back here, look, there's a camera and then there's a player. If I want to go to camera, you go down, you see how that, that thing lines up. And if you want to go player, it goes up. And then if you want to turn it off, it's in the middle. Now that you understand how the camera works, this is what you're gonna need to buy, okay? It's one thing, but it's it's sold separately. All right, basically, the first cable is a RCA. This connects to your camcorder, and then there's the RCA cables. I'm pretty sure these are called the RCA cables. You need the adapter from the RCA into USB. This one is just an extra one. I don't know what the shit is for. I'm gonna keep it above. Also, you're gonna need a computer that has OBS. OBS is software. I'm assuming you know how to use OBS, twin. If you don't know how to use OBS, I'm not here to teach you how to use OBS. So I'm gonna keep it above. You wanna connect the RCA cables. Come on, yellow to yellow, red to red, and white to white. Come on, bro. If you were 2000s kids, you know about this. Now you have a USB to this joint, all right? This joint connects right here. Look, see that's right there. Open that bit up right there. And then you plug this bitch in. Blow. Boom. Got that bitch plugged in. Now you're gonna connect this to your computer. Now they have it plugged in. You're gonna go to the back and you're gonna put that bitch on the player mode, not the camera on the player. Okay? Boom. Once you have it turned on, you wanna go to OBS, right? Okay, here, here's OBS. Now, I have a camcorder one here already, but I have it disabled. Okay, make a scene, and then within the scene, there's sources. In the sources, you wanna go here to the little plus sign. You wanna go to video capture device. I'ma name this camcorder tutorial. Boom, right? You're gonna press on USB video. See how it's already blue? That's what it looks like inside the camcorder. Boom, press that. Now that you have this here, if you press the play button on the camcorder, you're gonna get that shit right there. See, y'all can hear the audio too. And then in order to stretch it, right now it's small. This is what it looks like on OBS. You're gonna right click, I go to, I'm gonna come over here to transform, and then you can uh, stretch the screen. Now you got the whole John on the screen. Feel me? Look, that shit clean the fuck. Look, and then you can do that bit like this. You can squeeze that bitch. You can make that bitch hit one of these. And all I gotta do is record. Now, the thing is, it is what it is. If you have an hour of recorded footage, you need to record it for an hour. It sucks, but that's just what comes with it. That's basically how I get the camcorder footage onto here. It's not that hard, it just requires time because if you record for an hour, you need to record for an hour on the computer. That's basically it, yo. If you find this tutorial useful, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. If y'all have any more questions, let me know. Make sure you turn on that notification bell too. All right, I'm out.